Hi guys, it's Laura here. Uh, this is kind of like a sit down video, but I'm gonna with shoot Gabby. it today with Gabby. I'm gonna shoot it today hey, Storm. Uh, at the barn. Storm, say hi. Storm. Say hi, bud. Anyway, welcome to today's extra video. Um, it is gonna be four things that I hate about our barn. Let's just jump right into this video. You guys should all know that I love our barn and anything that I say from here on in is not a deal breaker in any way. Every barn has certain things that not everybody's gonna love and these are ours. So let's get on with the video. I got that from Gabby. Oh. Okay, so a number four thing that I hate about our barn. It is the walk. The walk from the arena to the barn and back again. I know in my last video the things I love about our barn. The things I love about our barn, I said that one of the things that one of the top things I loved was the walk. It's true. We have a love-hate relationship with the walk, don't we, Gabby? Yeah, especially when you're tired. Yeah, especially when it's so hot outside. Like if the weather is perfect and we have lots of energy and nothing hurts on us from riding, then the walk is amazing. But when it's winter and the snow is really high, it's terrible. When you've had your lesson and your thighs are screaming and you still have to walk all the way back down, especially if your blood sugar is low because you've hardly eaten. Yeah, terrible. So that is the number four thing that we hate about our barn is the walk. Number three thing that I hate about our barn is that there is no grass in the paddocks, no fields, and no heated water troughs. So basically uh, that's under that's understandable, right? Not every barn has grassy paddocks, especially in our area. If you do have grassy paddocks, then you're super blessed. Our horses have to eat hay and grass whenever we can take them out into other areas and let them eat, which we do all the time. But yeah, it's unfortunate this barn just doesn't have grassy paddocks and it was it is something that is really important to us because I believe horses are way more healthy on grass. The more the more natural their state, the better for them, I feel like, but there's 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 just no grass here and it's nobody's fault. It's just I mean there was grass there and then they ate it all and then they don't have like a place they can move them in summer and winter. So grass is something that they only get sparingly and it's unfortunate and sad. And that's number three thing that we hate about our barn. Also, in winter time, you guys saw last winter that one uh, that um, our water troughs freeze up sometimes and there's people around the clock coming and uh, crashing the ice and taking the ice, at, the ice out. Fortunately, that doesn't last very long, but it is really hard. You need a um, the horses seem to do okay with it. They're used to it, but still, it's something that we aren't in love with and again it's not anybody's fault there's no not enough hydro down there to hook anything up to allow them to have to run that if we could run it it would be one of the first things that they would change number two thing that I hate about our barn is the distraction I know that I said I love that it's a family barn it is a kid-friendly barn and the girls have friends here but it's so they get so distracted it's so easy and it takes us hours we can easily blow six hours at the barn and it's not all about the horses it's about how the kids want to go and play their friends are here and after everything's done they want to waste time and and play and I get that but that seriously is eating up so much time for us our barn offers free water free hot chocolate um, they free coffee they have these little kool-aid things they have a bunch of stuff that is really nice and awesome, but they all keep my kids here longer than is probably necessary. So that is a number two thing that is really hard for me and that I'm not in love with about our barn. Number one biggest frustration about our barn is the size. Even though I really like it here, it is a small barn. It's a small run barn. There's only one instructor, which I love completely. Um, but it's small size while it uh, endears me to it. There's some um, things that make it the size um, an issue. Like for one, 
it can get really disorganized, especially during the week when lessons are going on. And um, sometimes we have like a water riders who are here and ready to ride at the same time and it just can't handle that many people in the ring. And as well, sometimes we'll be out here tacking up and there'll be so many people, people are in the aisle, it's just, it's just not optimum. So it can be a little bit disorganized and it can be hard, but like I said before, these are just things that every barn has. Every barn has something or a few things that are not optimum, they don't fit everybody. And these are a far, a, these are a few of the hardships um, for us with our barn. And um, I'm sure as we go along, we'll probably find more, just like we'll probably find more things that we love. I hope you liked this video. I hope you guys can relate. I wanna know in the comments below, what are some things that you hate about your barn? Like Storm? Storm's not a hater. He doesn't hate anything. Well, as long as everything is perfect for him, right? He's pretty picky, actually. He's not really patient either. He doesn't like to just stand here. He's like, where'd she go? What's happening? This summer, I plan to have a more scheduled upload um, program. I plan to upload more often because I hope I'm going to have more time. I have more exciting things to talk about, hopefully. Anyway, so stay tuned for that. I hope you've liked this video and see you in the next one. Bye guys. And don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.